lovely task of starting our spring cleanup. I can't say those walls are going to look any better, but where'd you go? Hey, girly. I think she's about ready to go broody, so that'll be interesting. She's attacked me once already. I don't know if you're going to want to be laying an egg in here while I'm cleaning out. But have at it. Another part of spring cleanup, I left the chickens so they could lay their eggs because they all kept coming in and I was bugging them. But uh, this fern, I had to trim up her feet. She's got something going on in the back end. I haven't figured it out yet what it is, but she's sore. And that's Dutchie. And there's a boy. Hey, boy. We're reducing our numbers because uh, well, I'm 23 weeks pregnant now, so if she's bred, she's bred. If she isn't, she isn't. And he's a weather, so he's useless. And then uh, that's a nice fern. Thank you. And yeah, Dutchie's my buck, so we'll see how that all goes. But this needs to be done as well, but I don't have to do it this year. This is my husband's job. You're so nosy today. This is my son's goat, so. He's probably here for life. You're a good boy, aren't you? What's wrong with you, huh? Miss Fern? What's wrong with you? Stop gimping around. The vet's too expensive. Anyway, those are my... What's left of our herd for now? Guineas. I don't really know what purpose they serve. I've had them for a couple of years now. I've had up to, I don't know, close to 30 of them, and now I have five. So, yeah, this is what they do most of the day. They run the fence line as if they don't know how to fly, so that's great. And the genius of them blows my mind because I have got two big windows in my barn like this. One of them smashed out from the guineas. And then I have another window that's smaller that's been smashed out from the guineas. And then I have my husband, well, my husband's workshop has a smashed out window. I don't know what's wrong with these birds. These are the only five that have lasted. I've had close to, well, I've had 20 or more. And the male that I have randomly showed up and he's taking care of my females. But since then he's had them across the road of the neighbors. So I don't know, I don't think they're gonna last this year. But Ida, hi. Hi, the protector. Now I'll say this, if you want animals to clean up the ticks to clean up the slugs to clean up anything in your yard not the geese look past the geese those ducks are the best thing in the world they do so much better than those guineas the geese are a better alarm than the guineas so if the guineas go i'm not getting any more but i am going to try and hatch out some of the eggs these are runner ducks they're hilarious but yeah, there's the king and some of his ladies. But as you can see, lots of spring cleanup. We've got pallets everywhere, broken sleds, broken glass. So this should be a good, good cleanup year, hopefully. And spring cleaning in the coop has concluded. I think she approves of it. I put, I finally put a hood over where my chickens lay because. I had, like, I had things over it, but the eggs were still getting, like, pooped on from top, so hopefully that'll work. And I put hay underneath of my perches because it is so much easier to clean out. Because it doesn't tend to stick to the floor quite so much, so I love that. But, that's the chicken condo, all clean, for now. So I don't know what she's doing. I don't know if she's going to be broody or... If she's just laying an egg. Looks like she's getting comfortable though. 
So my husband encouraged me to get back on to making videos and stuff again, so I guess this will be the beginning of it at the beginning of the year. The crazy goats running around. When we get a nice day, we get as much done as we can because we know this time of year the ground's frozen again and we've got a little bit of snow again and it's cold again. But the goats are loving it. So anyway, hope you enjoyed the video and hopefully there will be more. Thank you. Shalom.